Hello everyone, Kitfitsu Gaming here, and I'm bringing you back with episode three of TF2 Jack of Trades. Last episode, we played as Spy on a game mode that I am going to now disable because I do not like that at all. Makes it feel like it takes way too long for one game, and it doesn't really help me try and convey ideas or stats or anything about the two sides of each class being offensive and defensive. For Demo Man, I'm just gonna... that's Pyro. We are going to be playing with the Tide Turner for movement and for uh, the Islander just for uh, possible quick finish melees to kill people and the Iron Bomber, bomber because, well, it sounds like a basketball launcher. The Soundsmith pointed that out, and I can't get it out of my head. So every time I hear it, basketball, J -j just basketball. Anyways, um, yeah, for Demo Man, oh crap, we're, I thought it was said uh, mission begins in 30 seconds. We just joined in a match where the uh, where our team desperately needs help. Uh, for Demo Man, the Iron Barmer, um, it's more... It, that guy had a random crit on his pistol. I'm flustered. Let me start over again. Demo Man has many sort of melees that help you... I don't know. Get out! I'm... There we go. I don't even... Know. We're right in the middle of Jack of Trades, too. Anyways, Demo Man has many um, melees that you can switch to. From the Claymore to uh, the Islander to a couple of axes and bottles. Let's not forget the bottles. But each one has a disability, like the uh, Islander reducing your health... Uh, 25 points, so it leads you to getting headshot a lot. And I am going to die there, because I was not able to do very much. Um, the same thing with the 9-iron. It's just basically the Islander, but you got it as a random drop. And, um, there are many different shields that you can use in place of, like, say, stickies, and, um, and I, I personally like to use shields because it not only does a little bit more maneuverability wise it allows you to what is with the people trying to set up behind us the whole video is just going to be me trying to destroy this engineer stuff and not able to help the team out much but but i mean pretty much that i, I am helping the team by destroying that gear so it doesn't kill us as soon as it i don't even know you know what we're just gonna no, we're not using the... We're, we're, we're just going to have a freaking bottle out, because I feel like we need the he extra health here. Oh, Lord, this is... I, I refuse for this to be the video! No! This will not happen! I refuse for this video, for the content, to be just the freaking blue team... Trapped in spawn, not able to do anything. That sentry needs to go. The demo man I just killed needed to go. And this pyro needs to die. Just everything, everything's going wrong. I'm sorry, pyro. I'm trying to destroy this engineer's gear. There we go, engineer down, and we're going to quickly charge him. I didn't land the bottle hit, no! Uh, here I think, and I, I just... You know, the, the, the point of melee at this, you know what? For, for... Just giggles. Just for giggles. We're gonna see if we can have the hammer. Yeah. That way they, we actually have something decent. Um, okay. I think... Now that the engineer is finally dead behind us, we can try.
I think this sums up my video that I can't play Demo Man worth a beaver's dam. Much like I can't play Scout or Pyro. But for Demo Man, I know a little more than I do for Scout and Pyro. You know, the, the, the Pyro class, the most, the most obvious thing, oh, you just got a WM1. I can't freaking do that. I'm incapable of WM1 incorrectly. That is a curse imposed upon me. I failed to charge there and I need to run. I don't like this situation. Screw you. We only have a minute left. This is not going very well. We're, we're, we're gonna... How did he finish me off? I basically had half health. And he shot me once with a shotgun that wasn't crit. He didn't... Mm, okay then, just moving on from that. Can I? No, you don't. Luckiest random crit of my life. But this is where I die. This is indeed where I die, unless I can just charge escape. Medic! I thought they were done setting up behind us. I can see how the rest of this video goes. It, it just does not bode well for me. It just makes me look like an absolute idiot. Come on, engineer! Pay attention to the guy shooting behind you! No, you freaking don't! I have to. I have to. He Ubered me, and I have to touch the cart just to be able to push. Ugh. I hate matches like this where it just seems absolutely ludicrous what the other team is doing. And they're just spamming and being destructive in chat and just ignorant crap did anyone know how to disable the chat in tf2 because honestly cons considering how much bad things i see just like what lord farquad said I, I i would really appreciate if i could just you know disable it and save myself the stupidity of some of the others or the in the insensitive, insensitivity and stupidity of others, like Lord, like this guy and other people who just really don't care about what they, what their actions can affect others. But anyways, moving on from stuff that I really shouldn't be talking about. Defense for Demo Man, basically. The loadout just changes how you play or how you really defend and for the Iron Bomber you just really have to aim higher to get the stuff to move farther. And for Demo Man your job is just to target um, enemy builds but since they pr they might not even have an engineer. Like I don't think they will have an engineer go I okay there's like two of them. You're not doing it! This is my life. This is going to be my life, this video. To hunt down those engineers and stop them from doing whatever the heck they're doing! And I'm trying very hard not to swear right now, but it's becoming increasingly difficult. This is what I do to try and make decent co content for everyone. I try not to lose it, but really deep down inside, I feel like I should just really 
quit the match. Because sometimes it's just overbearing what the others on that team you're fighting do. Because it's really unnecessary. We somehow got that kill. If I'm going to be honest, this, this episode may get a episode two of, like, something that is better than what this turns out to be. Please reload for the love of everything. Okay, we're, we're... Because I am really not in the mood. I'm just going to, at this point, get a grenade launcher and a sticky to set up some traps. And this soldier needs to leave or spawn alone. Oh, I really thought that was, those would land up there. Oh wait, I still got a kill, okay. Really wasn't sure I was, I'm not really confident I really should have gotten that kill. And another kill. And another one. You know, just spam the grenade launcher. Feel like you don't get anything truly worthwhile accomplished. You can have, uh, I think you can have six at most. Oh yeah, I forgot. Why didn't I just pull out my melee? And why did I forget that if you activate one set of stickies, all of it just goes up in flames. This video is just a, it's, it's a, it's a car wreck. <sighs> I should have seen chat. Hello darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again Cause the vision softly is sleeping Look! For the love of everything good and pure! Why? Why do people like that exist? Why, in the ever-loving presence of God, would anyone willingly just sit in front of the other spawn and just kill people for no reason it's just a game there's no point if you have weapons that track kills or how many of one person you kill there's no point to it and if you think you have a there's a point to it you are wrong and need to reevaluate your life okay that's where I'm at right now. Not. Yeah, I, I think it's about time for some karma. We're just gonna place that right there. There's a, mech, there's a small health thing over here. We're gonna quick. If I can climb up this tree stump, I'd love to get this health. What am I stuck under? Can I? Okay, screw it. Just, just, just screw it. We're gonna destroy that teleport. I can guarantee you that one thing. We are, we are gonna destroy that teleport really quick. Medic, please. 
Oh, that was inc that was incredibly lucky. The freaking railing. And the lag spike. So now we get to see if the 90% time we always die happens. No, for once it's the 10% where we live and kill the guy. I ended up spraying Shantae somehow. Not really sure why or how, but, you know, it, 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 it happened. We're just gonna set up another one. Aw, oh, you're trying to kill me with my own explosives. That's a little cute. I have never met a pyro that has been successfully able to reflect any explosives of mine. That guy is a spy, and I'm not going to fall for your backstab. Get out of here. Oh, well, okay. That's on me. I didn't realize they had set up a... Tele uh, a sentry. Almost a teleport. Yeah, teleports kill people. Well, actually, they, they they really do. When you think about it, teleports can telefrag in TF2, so. Alright, so, we're not doing too good. There, there, there's, there's been a little... There we go. I was wondering how that... Uh, like, I was wondering why that spy wouldn't die. I really need to get the um, just sticky jumper for demo, because at this point, um, it seems stock grenade launcher and jumping is the thing that works right now. And it's... Didn't realize there was a spy until he shot me. Just keep shooting at this point. That that's all I can do. Just need I just need to keep shooting. Can we like set up a trap there? Hope it works. I'm I like thought I a part of me really hoped that guy was a spy, like an enemy spy, so I could like kill him. Getting a little heal from our medic there. Make sure everything's reloaded before we charge in here a bit. And we save our soldier there, somehow. And we save our pyro. Getting a couple of good shots, but not nothing concrete. Uh, we're we're going to pull back to the objective here. I'm pretty sure something screwy is going on. This is probably the longest... The longest video of the entire uh, Jack of Trade series. I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> we uh, we're we're um. I'm gonna be ending it, ending this video at like 40 seconds. So hopefully um, we we win. No. No, 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 no. You don't. I'm not dealing with any more 
of this match's BS. All of you are dying without a fun. There will be no whimper. You will all just lay down and die quietly. And we won! Thank you guys for coming to see my pain in um, TF2 Jack of Trades. And th this, this one was just bad, bad. I, I'm sorry for anything, but yeah. Next one's Engineer. See you guys in the next one.